Hello there guys, in this video I thought I'd show you my PC setup for my 50 subscriber special and how I make my videos. So first of all, we're going to start off with the tower itself, the computer. Now this thing I built quite a long time ago, but it's still good. Um, here if you guys want to see the inside, it's currently powered off. Those fans glow up blue when they're gone. And here is the inside. Not too shabby for an old computer. But the sand panels really scratch because, well, it's old, as I said, like five years old already. And the graphics card is the MSI GTX 60, 660 Ti Power Edition. Now, um, the fans, one of them doesn't work actually. I don't know how it actually survives without one of the fans working, but anyways, I guess it survives. Now, before I power this thing on, I want to show you guys one more thing over here. The Xbox right here is um, the Xbox 360. I use this to uh, record and film um, console videos. And this right here, this little thing right here, is used to help connect the Xbox 360 to the internet. So you can see. You can do that. And I can close it. And here's the capture card too. USB saves the, um, it saves all the captures to the USB. And I don't currently have it set up because I'm not using my Xbox to make videos right now. So anyways... Why not we power on my computer now? Okay, fans are glowing. As you can see, it clearly needs cleaning. I haven't um, actually cleaned it in quite a while. Sorry about that loud noise. My computer's old and loud. So there it is. Monitor's turning on. It's booting up. And yes, it still runs Windows 7 because I don't have um, money to upgrade to Windows 10. Anyway, so let's pull out our keyboard. Beautiful blue LED. Except it's going to be turned off. Now it's back on. Beautiful blue LED. As well as the mouse. And I use that headset to, for sound. Because uh, my uh, computer doesn't have like um, speakers. That I can just like blast sound out of. So yeah. And here's the setup. Just our starting up. So now. Um, I also by the way these boxes up here. That Windows 7 Ultimate one was the same one used to create that computer. And these home premiums are actually never been used. But I'm going to use them for future computers. Anyways, why not I show you how I make my videos now? So to start off, I use um, Action to record my videos. As you can see, it's currently running. I use uh, Vegas Pro 14 to make my videos. Now, I used to use Vegas 9.0, but I don't use it no more since I got Vegas 14, and it's more easier to use. And I use Photoshop to make the thumbnails. So anyways, I'll jump into how I make a video. So Action, I just mainly simply record a video. Now in Vegas, I just open it up. I gotta wait for this to open. There we go. So I go to my, I go to this folder, open videos. I open this. Now, as you can see, I clearly got um this right here, my intro. So what I would do mainly is I go to properties, right click it. And I click, uh, I d um, disable aspect, maintain aspect ratio and resample because it can make the video look bad and it can make um, the video have black bars if you do not turn off um, maintain aspect ratio. So to make sure it gets all the video, what I do is I click down here and boom, if these are around it, this is the parts that it'll render. So when I'm finished, I go to render as. Now I used to use uh, main concept, but sadly it doesn't work no more. So I used Sony instead, and it was faster for me. So I um, actually saved this on my um, 1TB um, recording drive. And so I mainly select Sony 720p HD. So if I, once I made sure I got everything, I just press render. And yeah, I want to overwrite it. And now I wait. And there. Now it's 100% complete, I can preview it. And that looks good. All right, so it turned out as I wanted it to, so now I can close Vegas. And then the second thing I do is I use uh, Photoshop to make these, uh, well I use Photoshop to make the thumbnail. So I wait for it to open. So now that Photoshop is open, I um, go to File, On, and then come on, Work, 
there we go okay so now that Photoshop is open and I selected my photo what I do is I mainly use the text tool which I press T to use and I type anywhere on the screen what I wanted to say like for, like for example thank you all for 50 subscribers now I make sure that it actually has um, a position I could put it in that looks good so I always make sure like uh, right there just for example and if I like that I go to file export export as export all and I mainly save it here so um, I can name it whatever like let's just do this and I just press save yes and boom alright we got it so I thank you all for watching and hope you enjoyed that special and I'll see you guys next time peace out